There was a young girl named Mary. She had someone that she was going to soon be married to named Joseph. One night, the angel Gabriel came to visit Mary and told her that she would have a son. But this son would not be like a normal person. This baby would be the son of God. Gabriel told Mary this baby would grow up, be great, and reign as a king forever with a kingdom that would have no end. Mary and Joseph were to raise this baby and name him Jesus. Most kings are born in a big palace with lots of servants to care for them. They're wrapped in warm, cozy blankets and their parents are very, very rich. Jesus, though, was not born in a big, comfortable palace with lots of servants. The Bible tells us Jesus was born in a manger. A manger in the Bible would be a cold, dark cave where animals would be kept. Jesus was wrapped in leftover clothes, not a big cozy blanket. And his parents were very poor. Jesus was not a king in all the ways that we would expect. Instead, Jesus was born in a lowly position to serve everybody else. Jesus' kingdom is very different from how the world runs, and Jesus came to show how his kingdom works. The Bible tells us that Jesus is God, the same God who created every mountain, every ocean, every plant, bird, and animal. Jesus even created you and me. The Bible tells us that God is perfect, and he gave his people a set of rules that if they followed perfectly, then they could be free from the power of sin and death. People could live in perfect harmony with God like he always wanted for his creation but no one could ever follow these rules completely. Since no one could ever follow these rules, how could we ever be free from sin and death? The Bible tells us that God had a plan to destroy sin and death forever. Since no person could live the perfect life by following all of the rules, Jesus would live that life instead. By doing what no one else could do, Jesus could take all of our sin away and give to us the perfect life. The Bible tells us that if we believe in Jesus, then when God looks at us, he sees us like he sees Jesus. Perfect. <laughs>